So this here is a top lit updraft biochar stove and basically what I'm doing is burning some wood chips in this paint can. I'm using a three inch thimble duct adapter uh, that I cut some holes out in that fits into that and I have an adapter going from that to a four inch gas vent pipe. And what that does is air comes in underneath here. You can see I have it sitting on some bolts so there's like a quarter inch gap between the paint can and this concrete block that it's sitting on. So air comes in through there. It fuels the fire here. Secondary air comes in through here. And what it does is whenever the wood burns off gases, this air feeds that, that gas burns. And what you get is a smokeless stove. And what this is doing really, ultimately, my goal, and what this is gonna end up with as an end product is uh, charcoal. Because what it's doing is it's a controlled oxygen burn. You're not feeding this any more oxygen than it needs to just get the wood off-gassed and into black carbon. If you, if you just had this in an open fire, of course, that would just burn it from black carbon down to ash. And we don't want that. We want charcoal so that we can use this for biochar. And this is a, one of the smallest and simplest setups, but it does get the biochar done. Now, of course, for my garden, I'm probably going to want a little more than that. As you can see, it's going to take a lot of biochar to amend all that soil there. But this kind of gets me started and just gives you an example of how that's done. 